now? Think Dean's waiting for us up ahead? We should meet up with him quick, in case the wolves decide they don't like him. Lord of Wolvendom, Great Wolf King of the North. Sharp of fang and keen of claw, and yet dwelling here only. No, nor does it know me. I only know these things because a previous traveling companion of mine once wanted to hear its story. All right, let's go see if that Abyss Herald has stopped by here. But where do we begin? Hmm, are you standing here because of these strange bonfires scene? Indeed. See that, floating above the flames? It's an abyssal spell. Knowing what I do of the Order's habits, they've probably left similar marks behind elsewhere. Let's have a look nearby. So, their reach extends here, too. Let's have a closer look. Bonfire under the Abyss Order's control? Looks kinda scary. Let's beat him up first! Spirit Plane! Attack! Let me weave you over. Solidify! One with my blade. Submit for judgment. Oh, that's that. Let's go check out that bonfire. Looks like this bonfire's also got something to do with the abyss. Have you finished searching? I searched around these parts and found some signs myself. But they were left behind by abyss mages, and there was no deeper abyssal power to them. It seems that even an abyss herald would not wish to make trouble with the Wolf King of the North. We should leave as well. If there's anything praiseworthy about that old wolf, 
It's his territorial nature. But now we're out of leads. Are we going to have to give up? No. There is one more place we can go. Let's get a move on then. I'll wait for you at Storm Terror's lair. I've heard about what happened to you during Mondstadt's crisis. When you came, this place was known as Storm Terror's Lair. But I suppose that this place is more Lair than Storm Terror at this point. In fact, if my memory serves, this ruin has had largely nothing to do with that dragon for a long time. The first time I laid eyes upon the ruins of old Mondstadt, the Dragon of the East had yet to fall, much less come to nest in this place. Huh? But Baima remembers that Tavalin first got in trouble hundreds of years ago. Don't think too much about it. Do you remember the light actuators that once sealed this ruin? If the Abyss Order is interested in this location, then they will not neglect those mechanisms. Let's go see what the situation is at those light actuators. Look! There are lots of monsters gathered over there! Swift and merciful! I will have order! I wouldn't call not having to gaze upon such a creature a shame, exactly. Still, I do believe that you will come across one eventually. Mm, no, you're right. If it's a really powerful monster, it would be best to go around it. <sighs> How good it would be if all perils one encounters in their journeys could simply be solved by going around them. Once upon a time, yes. I simply have experience from adventuring together with that traveling companion. Uh, you know, Dean, you keep talking about that person this and that person that. Where are they now, anyway? He... no longer travels. I'm afraid that traveling can be 
too exhausting at times. Oh, is that how it is? Well, why are you traveling alone then? I still have some things left unfinished. Once they are done, I too will return home to rest. <sighs> yep! And it's good to have a home to come back to, isn't it? We camp out a lot when we travel. Hey! Once you find your sibling, we should find a place to stay too, shouldn't we? Mm, Mondstadt's Fisherman's Toast is pretty tasty. But Liyue's Wanmin Restaurant is great too. Nah, either way, we should settle down in a place where there's good food. Home. Well, it won't be too late to think about where you stay once your journey reaches its end. While you're still traveling, you should... Huh? What's familiar? A familiar feeling, you say? It could be someone you know well, or perhaps a monster. Whichever it is, we should see it for ourselves, and thus see clearly. We can reach the top of that cliff from over there. Let's go. Oh, Dean moves really fast, doesn't he? Let's use that wind current nearby to catch up. Can you still sense that familiar feeling that you spoke of earlier? But it doesn't feel like there's anything around here. No monsters, no people, nothing. Indeed. There doesn't seem to be anything strange about this place. It doesn't look any different from the last time I was here. My traveling companion brought me here on our previous journey. Hmm. So, Dane, what about you? What's your favorite place? Me? I no longer remember. I merely followed that person around on that journey. That's all there was to it. Huh? A ruined guard's footprint. A ruin guard was wandering around here? No peace to be found, even for a single dandelion. Perhaps that dandelion bears some sort of scent that only you recognize. As for why, has it perhaps experienced something related to you? Uh, you're saying some real confusing stuff. Paimon doesn't get it at all. Do not rush. Vexation and anxiety are the enemy of rational thought. Your journey has only just begun, has it not? At least you now know that he is still on this world. At this time, the most important thing is the journey to find him itself. 
Yes. And this is something you must keep in mind as the meaning behind your journey. May you find your kin at the end of that journey. Well then, let us part ways here for now. Huh? You're leaving? Already? Only for now. Don't worry. We will meet again. After all, I did take 500 Mora and those three answers you gave me.